Hello everybody, welcome back to Tim Man Collections and today I'll be doing a uh, sort of a review on my Rob Zombie Halloween Asylum Escape Mask. I picked this up online from uh, Spirit Halloween when they had them, but if you want one of these, they got the one with the hair on it now, it's got a latex mask with it, but this one's a, uh, like a plastic, plastic, and uh, got a foam sponge in it for protection or extra comfort excuse me but uh the sculpt on this thing is really good i ain't lying it's uh the paint job is good on there too but it's just like uh it's that cheap plastic stuff so i mean if it breaks or something be like oh well you're gonna have to get one of them either a latex or make one out of paper mache yourself but that's what it's supposed to be in the movie but anyway as i put it on here ta -da. <laughs> it does fit but this darn nose right here is a problem because it feels like it's hitting against my nose but anyway it does look accurate to the one in the movie like i said but uh it's just i hate that it's, you know plastic but hopefully one day i'll be able to afford one of those custom made ones or make one myself for me but anyway uh yeah i thought i'd get on here and show you guys this one and talk more in depth about it but uh I would personally rate this one probably around a four. I'm sorry, but it's just like if it was more like the nose problem, like it feels flat. But I mean, for you guys with big faces like mine, it'll it'll actually cover your face. But if you have like a wider, uh, don't mean to offend anybody, but wider cheeks or anything, it, it won't cover. Okay. But anyway, that's it for now. Like subscribe and turn on those post notifications and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye.